Man UTD News Live, all the latest gossip from Old Trafford Wednesday, December 27th. Wenger takes aim at Mourinho 1450. Arsene Wenger has called on Jose Mourinho to stop whinging about a lack of funding after the Portuguese boss claimed £300 million is not enough to spend on players. I have been in that position for 21 years so I can't start to complain now, Wenger said. There have always been three or four teams richer than I am. I've learned to cope with that, we deal with our own situation as well as we can. Man City, Chelsea and Man United are all richer than us, you have to find ways to be successful, United urged to make Sanchez swoop 1300, Tony Cascarino has urged Manchester United to put all their efforts into pushing through a deal for Alexis Sanchez next month. The former Republic of Ireland star believes Sanchez has the potential to emulate Robin Van Persie's successful switch to Old Trafford. Manchester City are the heavy favourites to sign him and are expected to return with another bid next month after failing to complete a deal before the start of the season. However, Cascarino insists Sanchez would be the ideal signing to kickstart United's league campaign. I think United should try to snatch Alexis Sanchez from Arsenal, Cascarino told The Times. They managed it with Robin Van Persie, and Mourinho would be able to offer him assured starts, whereas he might face more competition at City. Mourinho right to moan about transfers 12.30. Jose Mourinho is right to bemoan Manchester United spending, because he lacks world-class talent at Old Trafford. That's according to former Republic of Ireland star Tony Cascarino, who claims Mourinho's squad is filled with very good players. I'm not surprised Jose Mourinho says he needs to spend more money. Manchester United don't have many world-class players, Cascarino told The Times. David De Gea is probably the best goalkeeper in the world and I rate Antonio Valencia is one the best right-backs in Europe. Paul Pogba has potential to be world-class and Anthony Marshall and Marcus Rashford are still inconsistent. After that United are short, Lingard sends Mourinho message 12 o'clock. Jesse Lingard has told Jose Mourinho to utilize him more centrally after his brace rescued a point for Manchester United against Burnley yesterday. Lingard scored twice after coming on as a second-half substitute to salvage a point against Burnley yesterday. He has been deployed in a more central position in behind the strikers recently under Mourinho and has been reaping the benefits with six goals in his last seven Premier League games. And Lingard insists he is enjoying his newfound role at Old Trafford. This role, further inside, allows me to be closer to the striker, to get in the box, create more things and obviously have more shots at goal, Lingard told MUTV. Tuesday, December 26, 2017 Who impressed for Manchester United against Burnley 11-25? Maruan Fellaini has cast further doubt over his long-term future at Manchester United with his contract expiring at the end of the season. Honestly, I do not know. I have something in my head but I cannot tell you, Fellaini said. This is my 10th season in England. Except for the very first at Manchester, I only knew good times, I'm still here, if Manchester did not want me anymore, they would have said that for a long time. They made a proposal, probably one will follow, whether I will accept it I do not know. You cannot arrange something like that in a jiffy, Marino's chat with Perez 9.30, Jose Mourinho has contacted Real Madrid President Florentino Perez about Los Blancos' current poor run. Spanish outlet Diario GOL claims the 54-year-old still possesses a good relationship with real president Florentino Perez from his time in the capital. Diario GOL say Mourinho blames Real's poor season on Zidane. The United manager was said to be left stunned at the club's tactical decisions in the Barcelona defeat. He supposedly thought the club were wrong to play Mateo Kovacic instead of the influential Isco and he used the chat with Perez to say that Zidane is out of his depth. Getty Manchester United have a long-standing interest in Real Madrid star Gareth Bale 820, Real Madrid are ready to sail Gareth Bale new month, according to Spanish publication Diario GOL. Manchester United are long-term admirers of the Welshman but each time they've tried to sign him Los Blancos have blocked a deal. However, Madrid are prepared to cash in on him in January while he is fit. Real club president Florentino Perez is still looking to sell for around £80 million though despite interested parties hoping to land a cut-price deal of an estimated £53 million.
Lukaku slammed 739, Sky Sports pundit Paul Merson has no idea what happened to Romelu Lukaku during Manchester United's draw with Burnley, I think Burnley would take 2-2 before the game, he said, I looked at the team sheet and it was open. I don't know what happened to Lukaku. There was no link-up play between him and Ibrahimovic, they got 10 late on at Leicester at the far post but their delivery from wide positions wasn't good enough, they kept beating the first man, Mourinho wants Mbappe 7 o'clock, Jose Mourinho is determined to bring Kylie and Mbappe to the Premier League next summer. That's according to Spanish publication Don Ballon, who say Old Trafford Chiefs have named how much the Portuguese can spend on him. Mourinho now wants to add the forward to his ranks to take United back to the top of the table. Red Devils bosses are prepared to splash out up to £222 million, 250 million euros on Mbappe at the end of the season.